to find more workflow related uh, fields in the workflow log so if you click on here we know how to check a workflow log we go here in the GOS G generic object services we click on workflow overview and here you will see by default these are the these are the fields but here more fields are hidden you can go and click on change layout and from here you can see other stuff so you probably want to see whether the, it was forwarded and what is the type of this work workflow to particular work item when this work, work item is overdue what is the substitute for okay so this is nice one okay and here you click on this button and here you can see all the substitute for so this this is pretty very useful because uh, you can find a lot of stuff that why uh, why these work items are assigned to someone or something so this is pretty useful and you can see all these stuffs and these are very useful and helpful if you want you can always go here and you can save the layout okay when you are saving layout remember one thing always create your own specific layout don't mess someone else's layout so you click create your own layout put your name okay and you put default and i think this user specific is not selected so we'll start with so there might be a security issue so we can put test just for the heck and next time what happens is I go back and now I go to the workflow log from here and if you click here you will see not sorry if you click here if you see all these new new fields are there because it saved them so this is very helpful and uh, this will give you all the different extra fields that you may need to analyze right away rather than you know going double clicking and checking on the steps so this this helps you a lot of clicks and a lot of time and easy to diagnose stuff and also it helps the business to do the audit portion